Hello there. Uh, it's been a little bit since I've done a plan with me, so I thought I would just come on and do this one, even though it's Tuesday and I'm super behind, but that's how it goes. That's how it is. So, um, I am using, as you can see, I'm using this kit from Sweet Kawaii Designs. Um, I used to sub to the Kawaii sub. There it is right there. This one's called Ice Cream Delight because it's super cute and you honestly get, you get tons of stuff for your money. So, um, most of you have probably seen a Sweet Kawaii Designs kit before. I'll just go through it really, really quickly. You get two sheets of, uh, full boxes. You get, uh, two sheets of washi. Now I just finished cutting down some washi. I, I sliced it in half to be able to use it for, um, seven days of the week. Um, so I'm going to just kind of do that. But this is what it looks like whole. And then I'll probably save this for another thing. Just like I'm not going to use um, all of these boxes. Obviously, I'm just going to use one. I think I'm going to use this sheet right here. Because I love this box right here. Why me? I love that. That's how my week feels this week. Um, okay, so I've got that. You get four weeks of date covers, which are super cute. You get four weeks of weekend banners, trackers. You got a bunch of icons and some scripts. You get your numbers. See how they're along the side. Um, these are half boxes. Big deco. Tons of headers, which I really ra like rarely ever use, but I might with this kit just because they're cute. And then a bunch of these like um, week trackers, like Monday through Friday. Some more little deco, and then like little half and quarter boxes. And then these are checklists. But I kind of feel like they're just good for deco because they're super cute. So um, along with that, you also get a full page sticker, which is adorable. Um, I was thinking I could actually punch this and just use it as a dashboard. But I think I might save this for when I go back into Astology. I'm not sure. I'll come back to that. Uh, anyways, let's get started. I'm still, this is in my personal wide Giglio. All my... My little planner bag is over here with like all my stuff in it that I use. Ooh, that was loud. Sorry about that. Not super like I'm on a break right now from my class from teaching classes, so I was sitting there and I thought, you know, I'll just throw this together really quickly because I need to get it done. Uh, these are some tweezers from the Honey Bee Shop. They came in um, one of the boxes. You know, Honey Bee Shop, you don't have to sub. Um, for the whole, like you can get her subscriptions. A lot of times she'll have extras, babe box extras. Not super crooked, my goodness. So I have a love-hate relationship with this paper. So this sticker paper is vinyl. And what's really cool about it is that you can pick it up super easily. Um, what I don't like about it is writing on it. You have to, let's find the days of the week. You have to use a permanent pen, which I do have a Micron. This is the one that I used. There's lots of different permanent ink pens that you can use, but it's just annoying to me. I just want to use, I just want to use my normal ones, you know, like I want to use my favorite pen. I don't always like the way that they look on there, so. And Monday, oh my goodness, I don't even remember the date. What was the date? I didn't film how last week came out. Um, I'll, maybe I'll flip through it. Oh, where's my little calendar thing? Oh, I've got a big calendar over here. Hold on, let me look. I can't remember what today's date is. Uh, today is the 12th. So that means yesterday was the 11th. Let's find the other page that has, there they are, the numbers on them. You get so much stuff and it is a little all over the place. So for me, like I just have to keep going through. So yesterday I worked, so I think I'm gonna use those. I really like the little clouds. Again, let me go through this whole thing and find it. <laughs> And so I think I'm gonna use the clouds to mark work. And then I'll just put a little icon sticker there. 
And then let's put a checklist down because these are so cute. Yeah, I like that. Okay. So for Tuesday, so I gotta cut this. Where's my scissors? And we're gonna cut right here. Um, I've seen a lot of people do this where they cut down the washi. I've never done it before myself. So I thought I would try it on this one. This is my first plan with me where I cut it down. And for this particular washi, I felt like it worked pretty well. Um, because you have like the top has like, has the, how many times can I say like? Can you tell I'm from California? It's our, our California word whisker, like, 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 like. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Work. Um, anyways, the top portion has like the cones and then the milkshakes and then the bottom portion has the, um, oh my gosh, you can't even see that. I apologize. You can even see what I was doing. I'm out of it today. The bowls of ice cream and the little cupcakes. So it kind of worked to slice it. And then let's use, let's use one of these ice cream sandwich ones on the side. And then I need my days of the week. I do really love these days of the week. Sweet Kawaii Designs is just super cute. I don't have a code for Sweet Kawaii Designs, but um, you know who does is Robin. If you have ever watched Robin from Talks from the Heart, she has a code for Sweet Kawaii Designs. So just go to her YouTube, um, Talks from the Heart, and you'll find it there. Well, let's do this. Oh, what did I just do? That's wrong. Oh my gosh, is that Monday? Okay, this is Monday. Good grief, Vanessa. This is why it's great that it's vinyl because you can see how super removable it is. I wasn't even paying attention that these were going across. And so I put Saturday on there instead of Monday. Okay, that's cute. I think I'll probably go back through and use some of the big deco. Um, let's use this one. on some of these pages too, just for decoration, because I think they're really cute. Anyways, this week is kind of, I mean, it is what it is. The week, work has been really slow this week. We have, um, most of you know, I just reiterate it for any new viewers, um, which if you're a new viewer, welcome. Welcome to this. If you're looking for really perfect, beautiful planning, you are in the wrong place. But if you want to laugh at me, with me, while I laugh at myself, then you are in the right place. <laughs> we don't have a perfect show here. What we have here is just me having fun with my planner and not worrying about being perfect and using whatever stickers I like. Yes, I will reiterate this now every, every video. <laughs> If you saw my last video, if you guys, all of you who sent all of your encouraging messages, by the way, that was so kind. I really, I got so many messages last week that were like, hey, I'm 50 and I play with stickers or hey, I'm 40 also, or I'm 37. And um, I had gotten a comment several times that was just like, how old are you that you play with stickers? And I was like, I'm old enough to know that I don't have to worry about your opinion. <laughs> I'm 43 and I play with stickers and I love playing with stickers. Um, so anyways, I got so many messages, you guys, from you guys, um, on that last video that were just like, Hey, I play with stickers too. And I was just like, yay. Like I'm not hurting anyone. It's just for fun. It makes me happy. And yeah. So anyways, that's what we're about here. Sometimes I feel like my planner looks really grown up and adult, and sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it looks like I'm eight years old playing with stickers, and that's okay. 
I still love a lot of the things I loved when I was eight years old or 13 or whatever. And I enjoy, I really enjoy it. And it just, you know, sometimes, um, I talked about this on one of my videos. I used to plan all the time. I started planning. I think I got my first planner when I was like 11. And, um, so I don't work Thursday or Friday, but I do have some volunteer work that I do. So we're just gonna use these clouds because I really like them. I think they're super cute. And then I'll just put my main activity for the morning there. Um, and then let's alternate our checklist. We need to do our chocolate ice cream sandwiches because they're so cute. Anyways, um, and then I kind of got away from it. I had kids, I was busy, um, I've always worked part-time, I've been involved in a volunteer work that I do, and just, you know, life being crazy and busy and everything like that. I kind of want to move that down a little bit. Mm. Anyways, um, one of my friends, <clears throat> who might be watching this, <laughs> one of my friends introduced me to Hobonichi Notebooks in 2020. Um, pandemic and I got a Hobonichi and started playing with it and started watching YouTube videos about people planning and just absolutely fell in love with all of it I didn't know there was a planner community out there I didn't know there were people on YouTube doing this kind of stuff and I just love it it's so soothing to me I love watching people plan um, all different types of planners. I love that. So yeah, I just have a great time with it. Okay. Let's see. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay. Mm, where did I put the days of the week? There they are. Saturday. So anyways, probably lost my train of thought totally, but I'll do a quick little flip. I did a few changes. I need to do, I did a planner flip. I don't know. I know, like I watch a couple different planners who do a flip every uh, week on their planner. And I thought about doing that. I just don't know if I, like enough's changed or whatever that people would want to see a flip every week. But I feel like those are the videos that are most watched are the planner flips. Um, I have made a couple changes. I think I might maybe do one every two weeks or something just because I feel like it's kind of similar. Okay, cute. So done with the days of the week. What do I have on here that I can put down? Day off, day off, day off. Okay, I can put these appointment ones down. So... I'm just not sure how that looks. Ugh. I don't know if I'm going to use that box. I'm not happy with the way that pin looks on there. And I'll oh, see it's still smearing even though it's permanent. Oh, see, now I can't use that. Okay. But I only have one appointment script. And I have two appointments. So. Oh, that sounded like the, the play Among Us. Uh, that's one of the things that we did with my nieces and nephews when they, um, during COVID, everybody was playing Among Us, and we would do that. Where should I put this? Well, that's cute. Um, okay. So for appointment, maybe I'll use one of these little boxes. I'm gonna put this one over here because I don't want a color block. And I'll put my appointment here. And then I'll use a different color for my son's appointment here. And I guess we'll just use appointment. I don't want to not use the script only because I have just one, but I wish I had more. Okay. 
I'm just looking at these to see what I have, if there's any of these that I want to use to put anything down. I could use those for work. I could use that for work too. And then we'll use this little guy at the computer. I mean, he could be actually at a TV, which is fine. But I'm going to say it's a computer. <laughs> It looks like a computer to me. Yeah, that'll be good. Oh, I gotta put this down for yesterday. Yesterday was not a great... Oh, I'm gonna wait because... Okay, I gotta do full boxes too. That's all the main stuff for that. And we've got those. Okay, everything that I'm done with, that I'm kind of finished with, I'm gonna put to the side just because there's so many of these. Now let's see for full boxes. What do I want to put? This I wanted to use this kit because I live in California and it's been like 105 Monday. Today's gonna be like 103, so it's just gonna be super, super hot. So the, yesterday was the hottest day of the week, so we're gonna put why me. And I feel like we'll just put that right there. Very cute. Uh today. Why don't we put stay cool? And then over here, I'm thinking I'll put this one because I can kind of overlap this washi on top of it. Cute. I like it. Thursday. We're gonna put this. Oh, let's put this one. I'm trying to like purposefully not match the colors, you know, like to do opposite. You know what, maybe I'll put some of the deco, the big deco, instead of a box there. Let's put our weekend banner down. Actually, that might kind of solve the problem for this one, because if I put the weekend banner down kind of like this, I think I need to move that washi up, because I like the little faces. See the little faces on the ice cream cones and the, the milkshakes, aren't they cute? Okay, let's see if we can get this down straight, shall we? That's pretty good. And then we'll put this weekend banner like... Yeah. Okay, that's cute. I like that. Saturday and Sunday. So for Sunday, let's put ice cream solves everything. And I'll put this one up kind of like that because Sundays aren't super busy around here. And then we'll put this one for Saturday. That's too crooked. Cute. Okay, done with full boxes. And that's what we have left. I have a couple of these which I might use through the week trackers so here's where we come like i love all these trackers but again i've got to find a pen that will work on these and not smudge so i don't know if i want to put the trackers down or not i have all these headers but i don't know if i want to put a header like where like on top of the boxes i don't know i don't think i'm going to use those deco so we have some really cute deco maybe i could use One of these up here. Oh, I gotta move that down. It's too high. Hold on. Cute. Okay, I like that. 
Yeah, that's a little bit busy, but that's okay. This is my corner around her. It's all upside down. Um, I don't feel like I need to put anything. Do I want to put anything up there? No, it, I mean, it feels pretty busy already. So... I feel like that's good. I feel like it's good. So I have a ton left of this kit. I still have a ton of this washi. Maybe I could put like little bits of washi over here. Hmm. I'll have to think about that. But I don't want to add too much. I feel like it's pretty colorful and bright and I like the way that it is already. I'm going to trim that off because it's a little bit over the edge. Not too much. So if you have questions about any of the stuff that's in here, these inserts are from Creatively Planned on Etsy. Creatively Planned. Uh, Lisa's a good friend of mine and she does a beautiful job. She customized these for me because I wanted a timed daily, but I didn't want anything written there. I wanted it blank. I love blank inserts because then like if I get, you know, next week I want to go into a standard Stology or something, which I might do. I don't have to feel like I'm wasting any inserts because they're dated because I can come back to the you know next set of them whenever I want to. Um, I do need to put, oh, that's Saturday because I do have some classes Saturday, but I don't think there was any more work icons, were there, that I could use for that one. You know, we could just use this little, what do we have? That's like cleaning. Oh, why don't we put a coffee cup? Because I will have my coffee while I work. That works for me. And I will probably put these in. I should put my payday in. Payday will be on Thursday. We can put a little payday over here. We'll put it over here. Bink. And then I already did a grocery shop. So I should put that in. Did that yesterday. I vacuumed yesterday and put that down. I was kind of thinking, okay. So I was kind of thinking about doing like a tracker for vacuuming. And I can put it over here. This um, is an insert that I want to say I got on Puffin paper. It doesn't have it on the actual thing. It was a freebie. But it's like for breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, and then shopping list. But I thought I could put a couple trackers, like a vacuuming tracker. Um, I could put another one for like cleaning or things like that that I like what I do through the week just so I can keep track of that. And then I kind of wanted to do, it's a little bit crooked, there we go. I'll use, I kind of like this little cleaner. We'll put that there. Oops. <laughs> yeah, there we go. And if I decide to put anything else there, I will. Obviously I've done a great job of tracking that so far. <laughs> I'll go back and fill that in though. So, okay, let's just take a look really quickly and see what we have so far. So, uh, this is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And I think that's super cute and very summery. Um, I don't know why this is bothering me so much because it's not lining up with that. And I'm trying to decide if I want to move it. And I think I kind of do. Not that it matters, but. Just a little bit bothering me. Okay, so this goes here. Like so, and then we'll just put this. So that it lines up. See if I can do it straight. Okay. Better, 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 better. Okay, let me show you guys how last week turned out. It turned out pretty cute. 
This is a kit from Christine's Paper Studio. It's actually called like the Canada kit or Canadia kit. I just thought it was super pretty and it felt really summery to me with the mountains and the colors. Um, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday or Friday, Saturday, Sunday. That's how that turned out. And yeah, if you guys have any questions about anything, let me know. I did change the deco around a little bit. I got one of the grab boxes from No White Space Stickers, and this is probably my favorite thing. If you haven't seen Big Hero 6, you should. It's a really good movie. It's very emotional. Anyways, I like that. So, all right, guys, that's it for me today. Have a great day. Bye.